How are you doing, everyone? So, road signs. This will probably be the first thing you're asked when you sit down in the test center. They do generally ask a lot of the same ones. So I have done a short list of the most popular ones. Also, I have done like all the road signs in other sections as well. So I'm going to give you the most popular ones first because let's face it, they're the ones that everybody wants and needs to know. All right, I think there's about 16 in this section, all right? We're going to start from the top left. This one here is a very popular one. It's the red circle with the red X going through it. That simply means clear way. Clear way means you can't park in that area where that sign is. That one is a popular one. So the circle with the X, clear way. To the next one, we see here a picture of the P and very importantly, the lion going through it. All right, so that one means parking prohibited or else parking not allowed. All right, if this had an information plate underneath it, it would be parking prohibited as the times shown. All right, so that's all that simply means. This one here is a very popular one. In the Get It book, it says max speed limit 80. I don't want you to say that answer. I want you to say proposed rural speed limit. All right, this one comes up a lot and it's a tricky one. It's the proposed rural speed limit. All right, this one here, no entry to vehicles. So you would see this at the end of a one-way street, but it would be facing the people on the other end of the street telling them not to drive down because it is a one-way street. To the left again, this one here we can see, it's basically an upside down U with the line going through it. That simply means no, you turn. We see here the two cars side by side, one car overtaking the next with a line going through it. No overtaking. This blue one here, it is a popular one and it's so simple. All it means is just keep left. You will see these a lot as you're driving along. It's just basically telling you keep to the left when you're driving don't drive onto the wrong side of the road try look out for them as you're walking around but they you will see them everywhere it just simply means keep left there's two different roundabout ones you see this one here without the dot in the middle means roundabout the head again that's a popular one if it has the dot in the middle it's a mini round about the head, all right? So the one with the dot in the middle is a mini round about the head. This one here, school ahead. So we know we're driving along, we can see the picture of the school children. We know that's a school ahead. Now these three fall under the same category and these are popular as well. If you see the picture of a fence, that means it's a level crossing ahead, guarded by gates or lifting barrier. This one is a tricky one. It doesn't say it's level crossing, but them gates indicate that it's gates guarding the level crossing. A level crossing is where trains will go across the road. So we see the gates, level crossing ahead, guarded by gates or lifting barriers. The next one, we can see the train tracks, but there's an X going through it. 
So we know it's a level crossing ahead because we can see the tracks. But the X going through it means it's unguarded by gates or lifting barriers. So we see here gates and the X means no gates. So gates means level crossing ahead guarded by gates or lifting barriers. Train tracks, X going through it, level crossing ahead, unguarded by gates or lifting barriers. Now, this one. So again, this is a level crossing ahead. But as we can, we can see it's a train, so we know it's a level crossing. We can see the lights, usually when there's lights, there's barriers. So level crossing ahead with lights and barriers. This one is a popular as well. You would see this as you're driving along, coming down maybe a dual carriageway or something, and then you want to take the slip road and it loops around. That simply means loop road ahead. Just the road goes in a loop. Now, red circle, white in the middle. That means pedestrian zone. Very important, that one. That one is a very popular one. So red circle, white on the inside, pedestrian zone. And these blue ones here, the blue ones mean that they're on a motorway. One, two, three, every line means 100 meters. So we know that is 300 meters to the next exit. Now they could show you the one with one stick, which would mean 100 meters, or a sign with two, which would mean 200 meters to the next exit. Usually they throw one of them in. All right, so they're the most popular that I've come across. The school, the, one of the level crossings, pedestrian stairs, the roundabout ones, and also, especially this one, these ones, any of them 16, you could be asked, Proposed rural speed limit. That's what we're saying for that one there, all right? So yeah, well done. The next section will have a lot more in it, all right? So well done, see you on the next slide.